Welcome back. In this video, we are gonna do a lot of the smaller things, I would say. We have received the parts that we ordered under double insider points, or most of them still haven't gotten all the non bestsellers, so we are still needing a bunch of these. These are for the from, from the last time I ordered them. So we've gotten most of the parts for this, so we can do four. Still, and that, that's these four that we, or these with News 44, and we still need the last one. And we have ordered uh, a lot of tiles, 2x2s, 2x3s, jumper tiles, uh, 1x4s for some of the tree, yeah, what do you call them, stands? Not tree, three, tree stands. Um, we did also buy this. <laughs> This one, a uh, bit of a mistake because um, <laughs> they're supposed to be <laughs> reddish brown, but I think I ordered them in some kind of medium nuka or what it's called. So I'm gonna do something about that. I'm gonna do something about this. I think this is finally gonna be the the episode where we are gonna build um, those or that, and we are gonna try to see how much of this down here we can mill. Not that we are gonna do uh, half or 25% uh, of it at all, but I have ordered some green plates, some bright green plates from Bricklink, and they should arrive within a couple of days. And then I ordered a bunch more. And I do have taken away all the, the white plates I have to see how much of that I can I can plate because I don't have to plate underneath the uh, the house I just have to do something that it can be put on I just have to see what I'm I'm gonna do about these corners but I'm quite excited because I think it's gonna be very 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 good if we are gonna mills plate all of this especially the train line that's what I am looking forward to the most and then to see how we can uh, ballast everything and making these tree pieces a lot better. But let me sort this or get it away. Let me just make uh, whatever I can do with this. I'm not sure it's gonna be right here because when we are gonna change everything down here, it is gonna, or when we're gonna mill everything down here, it's of course it's gonna change. But I'm quite excited about it. I don't think we're gonna most play that down there, the amusement park, not at first anyway. So we're gonna keep keep it to this at first. But let me see how far we can go with what we have. And just to show you this, not because it's a, a big surprise what we got. Uh, I also wanted to show you something over here, but it is a little bit more of the uh, one by twos, sorry, two by twos two by threes and then three of these fence pieces for the net and the volleyball court. Two by twos, sorry, two by ones. The wrong one by sixes should have been this color. Uh, and then again, these. But um, we also did order a few minifigure parts uh, for the beach. So I tried to order some all yellow so it could look like they don't have any clothes on. But I didn't really find anyone with shorts or bare legs so i just ordered a few and then i still have a lot of, of faces over there but when i went to the lego store i bought a cup with all of these so this is i would guess maybe a hundred of these torsos for the price of a normal cup and just to say that one of these or <laughs> about 20 of these would be the same price as i bought all of those for so there's a lot of duplicates but uh, there are quite a lot of of the uh, the ones i actually bought so i tried to buy things with with no sleeves and, and stuff but i still need the legs so, so <laughs> sorry <laughs> i'm sure it uh, it doesn't sound good, but I still need a lot of legs and I did order some other places and I do also have some that is coming from the Lego website. 
which isn't best sellers. So yeah, and then something down here, these two, well, primarily where the uh, lamppost on the modulars and then some jumper plates, a little bit of each. So we have quite a lot of pieces that we can, uh, we can use. So now we just need to do something about it over here. And that is how quickly you use 100 two by threes. I know there's a lot of dust, but I'm gonna do that afterwards. But I <laughs> filled up that and I filled up that. I didn't expect that I could fill out uh, all of it and I didn't actually want to because I think when I'm gonna redo this, I will most likely have a bunch or actually some at least of the two by threes. And I don't know if you saw it before, but this was what I was intending to do with um, with the yellow torsos, using them as bare chested, so men, of course. And I did this. I don't know if it's the right size, but I kind of like it, sorry. And you can see the net is pretty much just two, two by six, sorry, one by six and a one by 10 with these modified one by twos with holes in them. So I can I can make it taller and I can make it lower uh, depending on what I am using it for. So now I just need to put up some people in there. But again, it's not gonna stay there if I'm gonna make everything over again. So we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. But now I will try to see how much of a milk plate I can do for that one, how much I have and how much I need. And yeah, it's gonna be good. So not that I expected that I would get all of it done, that I had enough white plates, but I did think I have had a little bit more. So this is what I came up with. I used, of course, putting the uh, Home Alone house on top. So everywhere where you see a plate is where the Home Alone house it's gonna be, and this is only a 48 by 48, and over here I'm having it on a 48 by 64, so I still need to get the last end here. But I'm just gonna cut the um, 48 by 48 plate right there, so it's not a problem. The ones, some of the ones I had wasn't that pretty, so they are gonna go in the back. So I just need to get some more of these white plates. I don't think I have any anywhere but not a big problem but that's just gonna go down here to be used at a later point but and there was my butt again sorry i did receive my some of my brickling order uh, 179 or something like that bright green four by fours and I am gonna use them to see if I can mill this, first of all, because there is gonna be four studs uh, on the side. And then I have to see what I'm gonna do with the rest. I don't think I have enough plates, or I'm, not, I'm completely sure I don't have enough plates to, just have to remember which one, to, to cover them all. I think I have a few of the one by twos. Yeah. My dog is shedding at the moment, and they've had some kind of toy animal that they have completely destroyed. But that's going to be... <laughs> I don't want to do that now. But yeah, so that's the thing. And then we did this one. So we only have the uh, these pieces to, to do four. So that's the only one that has been made at the moment. There's a bit of an issue. I'm an idiot because this is not a problem. This is how it's supposed to be, how it is up there. But uh, <laughs> these ones, I forgot to take into account that I cannot put three of the uh, bricks with studs all the way around. So with four studs, I had to have two, uh, I had to have one that only have studs in front and the back. So <laughs> I, I couldn't put them together because if you have uh, the ones with four studs all the way around, you cannot put the side tile on. And so I I, I wanted to see, and I, I thought about either just having uh, it without the side tile or having it without 
the uh, yellow on one of the sides. So that's what I did first of all. But I'm going to order uh, some other of these at some point. So right now it's going to be like this. It's not a big deal because it's only one of the sides that is is wrong. But still annoying. Let me just put it on. And you just saw it from a side. Yeah. So that's a thing as well. I think it's gonna come come along. It's a lot of small things, but and the hole it's gonna be big. But let me try to see if I can make I think I'm just gonna steal this one instead of taking it out down there. It's gonna come back at some point. So let me see. And I just put together what I had in my storage. So I am gonna need a lot, of, a lot, of, a lot of parts to to do these. But just to see how it looks. I know that you've probably seen it before on on other channels, but I really like it. So I do need a bunch of plates. You can see here that it has been raised two plates, and and then the the sides are still uh, a plate and a brick. And I'm putting these connectors on the sides, but not on the ends. And that is because, yeah, it's pretty much a connector in itself. I am going to need, as I said, a bunch of plates. So I'm going to need uh, a lot of uh, one by twos and I'm going to need a lot of two by fours in dark blue gray. And I'm going to need these um, one by one tiles in red blue, uh, red blue gray, I was about to say in um, reddish brown to do all of this but just just think about how it will look all the way down here with the with the train in the plate i think it's going to be look i think it's going to look so good and then that you cannot look in between not because i don't like how it looks but i think i'm going to i'm going to like this uh, even more so now i I have to order a lot of parts. It's not because it's that many parts, and I think I'm I can find them on on Bricklink instead of doing it on on uh, on Lego's website. But I'll check. But I, I I really like it. I really like it. I I hate when I get these thoughts and ideas that it just have to be right now, and because it's always gonna be a lot of work for me. Uh, I just have to figure out what I'm going to do on the corners. But again, I know there's a lot of tutorials, a lot of people who have made them. So it shouldn't be a problem to figure out how I'm going to do it. Also, covering in the uh, the middle part. Uh, it's not difficult with this. It's just a couple of, of tiles. Um, but yeah, I really, 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 really like it. Damn. But on to the to the next one. I actually don't know what I'm gonna do right now. I think I'm gonna maybe I'm gonna do a couple of more of those, or I'm gonna start uh, filling up the uh, inside here because again it is a a thing here. And I, again, I have to figure out if I want to do anything about the the walls. If I have to raise them, or I'm just gonna keep them because I don't think it's gonna be a good idea for me to connect these with the walls even though somewhere it would be a good idea for example over there you can see there is a small gap very small gap so maybe i could i could get rid of that but i have so many ideas right now so few parts so let me see if i cannot if i can't uh, order a couple we have finally built this and for you people who doesn't know how it is made it is a lot of of modules that you can put together pretty much however you want to. So I still have to figure out what would be the best configuration of this. So this is not it, but I want to wait until I built the surroundings around here. So I figure out how I want to have this. So now it's built and placed, but not um, really because I still need to, to do the, the mills, I think. And I have actually started. We have finished the mills plate for this. And as I said, um, I want to have the wall on the same plate. So it's going to be around this. I might change it and push the 
front part of it out on this plate just because that is what I am planning to do on these rope plates. So now there is stuff on the way and we have started. Just went and bought five of these packs. So now we can do 10 of these rope plates. I still haven't gotten the uh, the extenders here. So, but I have the plates for the sidewalks. I have the tiles, I think. I have most of the bricks to un for underneath. Uh, I just need um, the, uh, the extensions uh, of the road. And we have ordered a lot of, of plates, uh, both whites and suntan, because <laughs> we did do a 3,300 and something part order on Bricklink, and it was very cheap. We got these for less than 400 Danish crowns. I think that is, what's that? About $60, less than $60. Uh, and then with shipping, but it's in Denmark, so it's not that much. Uh, we found out that they had these one by twos, uh, a lot of them for about 7.07 crown. So about one cent each. And I bought all, all the ones you had. So now we have a lot of pieces or they are soon going to be on the way. So we can do all of this in mills. And as I said, have ordered a lot of, of the whites as well. And from another Brickling order, I have a, a bunch of the uh, the green ones. And we do have the uh, the one by, uh, the, sorry, the four by fours over there on the messy table. So it's... It's looking very, very good. I am going to start in this area and work myself down this way, or I think I'm going to start with with this and then go up here. So this is going to be the first, I think. Maybe I'm going to take some of, of the houses. But that's going to be the last of this area, and that is going to be the last of the entire down downstairs, I was about to say. And this over here is still a mess. Thank you, Mrs. Looney Bricks. <laughs> but it look, it's looking good. That was all we had to show you in this video. A lot of smaller things has been done and a lot of plans for the other things have been made. So now we just have to wait for the rest of the pieces and then we can, then we can go on. I hope you enjoyed this little update i uh, hope you liked it if you did thank you if you didn't nothing much i can do about it now so until next time bye <laughs>